Hello everybody, my name is Faywell, and welcome back to Song of the Deep. Now, the last episode, I fought the Watcher, and what's interesting about that is that even though I had done it technically twice, I did it twice as fast the second time. So I'm actually at the point where I haven't seen what's next, and I'm really excited to see what's there. I, I actually have a hard time putting this game down. You know, actually, I do want to go back to the Armor Crab first and see what I can purchase, if anything. Looks like I can get Torpedo Trap. Torpedo Trap, grabbing them, claw immediately after they are launched. Press claw after. So that's a trap. That's interesting. I want that. I'm gonna get that now. Okay, let's see what's up here. Alright. Oh! I know where I am. Okay, so this area overall is not actually new. Like, uh, up above is not the beginning of Watcher's Hollow, but it's... It's near... It's near the beginning of the game, so I actually really recognize where I am. Oh, can I break that with... Come on. No, I cannot. Yeah, no, I cannot. So that's not the right way to go. sure whether I should go up or this way, but I guess I'll go this way. Oh, I wasn't there before. The ocean's getting a bit more dangerous. Okay, I need to be a little bit more careful now then. <laughs> it always surprises me when they die, they're so loud. I think I'm going- oh yeah, can I kill this now? No, no I cannot. I should be- hmm, no I can't go that way. I need- I have no reason really to not- I went the wrong way. That's okay though. Because I... Actually, there was something up here before. Nope, I can't go that way still. So down's not the way to go. Possibly. I don't know.
I'm not actually sure where I'm supposed to go. I'm assuming this is not how I move you, but yeah, that is not, that's not it. Ow. I need to be careful. That was not careful. This is so, the ocean is just more and more dangerous. Oh, okay, I found... Okay, I, I went the right way. Sort of. Swish had led Baron back to Kara's home in the Merrow Ruins, but the doors were sealed shut. Hoping to speak with her, Merrin searched for another way in. Nope, it's not that simple. I can't afford anything still. Oh, I should save. There we go. I can hear Swish, but I don't see him. Okay, time energy, time energy regenerates a lot faster than I originally thought that it would. Oh no, I think I just picked up uh, time energy. And make sure I didn't miss anything up here. I did. Hey there, Swish. What do you want? Is this the way you want me to go? I'll go that way, just... <laughs> Not quite there yet. I gotta wait for the right timing. Uh, I'm gonna try that later. A narrow tunnel led into the bottom of the house, but the submarine was too big to fit through. Uh huh. Oh, maybe, 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 maybe. 
gonna stop saying maybe. Uh, there may might be like a diving suit for Marin so that she can go through the. the small cracks that the submarine can't fit through. That makes a lot more sense than shrink my sub. As, as hilarious as shrink my sub would be. I don't know what that did. Oh. Uh, oh, I, I figured out what that did. See if I can get there fast enough. Nope. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> Go. No. Okay, put that down. Grab that. Pull it down. Now, grab, grab it. Go, 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 go. I'm not going. Okay, let me give this one more try. Now I will use the power of editing to make it so that people can watch this and not have to worry about seeing this happen 15 more times. I'll be back. Never mind, I got it on the next try. These ruins had once been a flourishing city. What had happened here? Where were all the Merrows now? That is a very good question. I thought they'd all be dead. <laughs> I mean, they're not all dead, obviously. A Fomori Cyclops turret scanned the quiet waters of the ruins. A solemn reminder of an ancient conflict. Oh, okay. So that means that the Marrows and the Mori were at war. My sub doesn't fit this, it's gonna suck. It doesn't fit. I'm really sorry, I think there's... It, there's gotta be like a diving suit for... Marin to get to be able to... Marin had discovered an old diving suit. She put it on and in her pocket of the suit, she found a striped seashell tied to a string. It looked just like the one her father kept above the fireplace. She tied the string around her neck, hoping the shell would bring her luck. Okay. That seems a little dangerous, but... You know, sometimes you gotta live dangerously, right? Marin held her breath and dove out through the submarine's hatch. She noticed bubbles coming out of the shell around her neck. Putting it to her mouth, she gently breathed in and felt the air fill her cheeks. Were these the same shells that were once used by ancient explorers? I imagine. I have a feeling that I was right. Marin is not going to survive so easily as the submarine will. Her breath 
and dove out through the submarine's hatch. She noticed bubbles coming out of the shell around her neck. Putting it to her mouth, she gently breathed in and felt the air fill her cheeks. Okay, I got to be... the same shells that were once used by ancient explorers? Probably. Uh, I got to be more careful. Turn to this up from anywhere. It's useful. I mean, isn't. Does it explain how? No. No, it doesn't. <clears throat> oh, okay. I need to. Huh. Sorry for the dog. <laughs> All right, so now I can go to deeper, not deeper depths, but I can go to smaller crevices and areas that the submarine just can't fit in. I feel like I need to go talk back and talk, talk to Kara first before I continue this way. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I guess you could call that a shortcut. Yeah. I mean, even if I don't need to talk to Car first, I still will go back and I'll show you what's over there. <laughs> I'm not sure how to get through that. As yet, she though. searched the ruins, Meron felt a pang of sadness. Was Kara the only Mero left? I hope not. That's really sad. As Marin approached, Kara slowly lifted her head. She looked pale and weak. With a gentle wave of her hand, she showed Merin a shimmering image of a tall tower beneath the sea. Kara spoke softly, 
and there was a touch of pain in her voice. This is the Deep Light. It was built long, long ago, and now lies dormant. If you awaken the tower, it will show you the way to find your father. She leaned closer and whispered the secret of how to awaken the Deep Light. Marin thanked her and said goodbye. She would find some way to repay Kara's kindness once she had found her father. The resonance orbs that once powered the deep light had been scattered across the sea. Kara had marked their locations on Meren's map, but she warned that retrieving them would be a very dangerous task. I'll have to keep that in mind, also. Oh. Oh. Alright, well, I'm gonna just go over here. You can see that it's... I think this is a good point for me to stop for a few reasons. Alright, so <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, why not give me a like? If you want to see more videos that I'm going to do in the future, why not subscribe? Goodbye! <laughs>